Hello YouTube. Um, well, I was watching that movie that on APC tonight uh, called uh, The Outsiders. Uh, I said Prime Time The Outsiders. That's the full name of it. And um, this group of uh, Amish left. And they're they're better than the national counties. They're a little different than than the than uh, swords and troopers. They're old order. So of course, burning a bucky, yeah, that would get you in trouble. But I don't see how why I would want anyone would want to go back after um, after what I've experienced. But I guess I think. The the old orders are are in a way better, quote unquote, and are easier to to live with their rules than than the rules of the swords and troopers. So I kind of understand why they decided. Some of them decided to go back, but. Yeah, that that's up to them what they would decide. Um, I couldn't go by it myself, but, but that's up to them. Oh, and uh, Joe Kaim, Charlie Horse uh, username, YouTube username. Um, he did he did a pretty good job of explaining it on on that video too. Um, anyway. Uh, Today I went over to Mom's house and I was I was discussing some stuff for for uh, writing a book and stuff. And uh, after I was about ready to leave, she's like uh, told me this story about my niece, which I kind of find of disturbing on several levels. Um, First, she, my niece was um, dating this Amish guy, and uh, and she uh, was told she can't, or, or either she told him off, or or somebody else, or her parents told her she can't date him anymore, or something. I can't. I don't know the details. And I don't really know that I want to know the details, but anyway. She starts dating another guy, and uh, the old boyfriend tells uh, came so, came over to um, to uh, Manisa's house, and uh, we want she wanted uh, some the other night. I, I uploaded. Uh, I didn't realize it had not uh, uploaded all the way. I don't know what happened there, but. Anyway, <coughs> what I was saying is that uh, uh, this guy uh, came over to my to my uh, niece's house, and um, he uh, I'm not sure exactly what old mom was talking about, but something about that she that he's asking for an address, and at one point he said that. One of them, one of the, her or her boyfriend have to die. And then he goes, takes a shotgun over to, to where my, uh, where her boyfriend, uh, new boyfriend, uh, was, uh, working on a forklift and shot at him, missed him. By, you know, just bullet went past his head. No, I would have done. I would have run too, of course. You know, if somebody's gonna shoot at me, I'm gonna be out of there. Uh, well, he, uh, the guy, ran off the tow motor, and you know, it, it, um, it ran into the lumber or whatever. Now, the 
part I don't get though is what my mom said that uh, that he got a one way ticket out of um, out of state but I'm not sure if that was the sheriff or her, or uh, or the local Amish you know told him you know get out of here you know don't don't come around here or what what but uh, it don't make sense really I mean that's attempted murder um, and you uh, you get uh, jail for that kind of stuff but apparently this guy got away with it that's why that, that was the, the end of this video but for some reason uh, either my recorder didn't work right or or YouTube didn't get the whole file or something something went wrong so that video didn't get, it didn't work all the way but Anyway, here's the rest of it.